Welcome to the Windows and Computer channel and of course uh, lots of people asking me to uh, do little updates on what is going on with version 2004 or Windows 10 May 2020 update. So of course as the rollout continues there are little things here and there that they find out the latest added to the page that I will share once again in the description below the video of known issues is the uh, local security authority subsystem service problem. So this should be fixed with patch Tuesday of July. So that is something that would arrive somewhere around July 14th. And the only fix really right now is to uninstall patch Tuesday of June. So this is the latest to add. The printer spooler problem has been fixed. If you look at my videos, I give you the links or just click the resolved KB article here. It should... Uh, be fixed you, you have a download uh, that you it's a manual download it doesn't come automatically through Windows update so you download it manually and fix your printer problems if if you had printer problems that started with patch Tuesday it's interesting that patch Tuesday was kind of a, a you know a, a bad one uh, quite a few little things happened with patch Tuesday um, you know if if there is one update every month that should not have issues or mi minimum issues it's really patch Tuesday and that one is a little uh, you know kind of a little sad to see that that added here so anyways this page will be shared with you guys you can go to the uh, page um, and uh, to the link in the description below the video and uh, check out the uh, blogs and they add stuff here all the time as uh, the status as something happens Apart from that, still a slow rollout, which is what Microsoft usually does. It is not available for anyone that has a problem that they know of. So that means that in your Windows version uh, here that I'm looking at, you should be, if you updated, you should be a 19041.329. If there is something that they know about that is a problem, you're not seeing it. Uh, one question, qu quite a few questions I will actually answer. One that somebody asked this morning is, is it possible that I saw this update at some point and when I go back, it's not there anymore? Yes, it is. If there was something not detected that prevents or might cause some issues, it's possible that the update was there at some point, then they discovered a little something and they thought, oh, we're gonna we're gonna remove it from that PC. There's a lot of people that think that uh, the May 2020 update is uh, halted and Microsoft is not saying it, sending it out. It's not at all the case. It is rolling out. It is rolling out to known computers that have no problem with it. So every little detail that they found that might cause issues, if you are one of those that could be at risk, it's not showing up. When you see it on your PC, because I see the comment of a lot of people saying, well, with all the problems, I'm not going to install it. Well, if you see it on Windows Update, it's because your PC is not one of those that's going to have a problem normally. So remember that. A lot of people think that, oh, well, I'll roll it out and it's going to have all the problems that people are talking about. No, you see it. It's because Microsoft deems that your rollout should be okay. So uh, if you go and, and, and seek it, um, you know, you, you can just ignore it, but if you go out and seek it, if you go out to the all settings and go into update and security uh, and check for updates, uh, basically, so I'll resume updates here, uh, check for updates, what's going to happen is that this is going to show up if you're compatible with it, uh, whether you're on 1809, 1903, or uh, 1909. One little thing that uh, some of you have asked some of you on 1809 because I did a video 1809 is being pushed to the version 2004 why because 1809 is soon to be retired this fall now a lot of you have been asking me well you know I don't see it what what's gonna happen if end of support happens look don't worry about it for now because the support of 1809 has been extended until November of this year. That means you still have 
um, you know, several months of updates. You got July, August, September, October, and November included. So it's five months. In five months, there will be fixes that are going to have uh, probably fixed whatever is blocking the update on your machine. So, you know, for now, you got Patch Tuesday updates. Once again, it doesn't matter. Anybody that has the Patch Tuesday security updates because there's on a supported version of Windows 10, it doesn't matter if you don't see it for now. It, it'll show up eventually. For the uh, other questions, uh, once again, it's roughly about four gigabyte download, and um, that is the um, that is the uh, the option here. So it's about four gigabytes of download. So that's f for people asking, and of course, because people have a different measure. There are I've seen someone say, "Oh, I've got you know eight gigabytes or twelve gigabytes online." That's because it redownloaded because it is around 3.9 4 gigabyte size. If you have more than that, it's either that it was with other updates, like cumulative updates or something, that increased the size of it. But if you have, you know, 7 or 10 or 15 gigabytes, it's because it redownloaded many times. Remember, if your internet connection has problems, this can cause issues with the image download and when it actually looks at the signature it realizes that the image isn't correct and it re-downloads it to make sure that the image is okay for the install process apart from that it's still running very slowly like i said they are checking out as much details as possible is there more problems on the may 2020 update than um you know uh, other updates Let's just say that they discovered new stuff, but the overall rollout, when you look at it, is in general still going well. And the majority of people have no problems with it. So, um, you know, for the rollout itself, it's it's okay. And what's nice, at least, is as soon as they see something, it's uh, removed from whatever machine that might have got it before. And it's not showing up until that is fixed. Um, so I think the next phase will be a patch Tuesday. On patch Tuesday, Jul July 14th, um, a cumulative update will arrive with it, with bug fixes probably. And the week after, July the 21st, will be a real bug fixing cumulative update. That might actually open up the possibility of a lot of people that don't see it that will finally see this um, update happening. Once again, no rush to get it uh, if you don't have it now. It's okay. Just use your PC. Someday I'll be there. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us a thumbs up. Thank you for watching.